Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to review the uh, Blue Master. Yeah. It's a toilet peel bulb. Fits the uh, the uh, Glacier Bay, the plopper toilets. It's an easy to install. It fits Niagara plopper uh, toilet. And uh, this is for the best performance use. Gen 1 Blue Master parts only. So the trusted brand of original manufacturer replacement parts. And I got this from Amazon.com. So it's a fast refill, corrosion resistant material. So I need to replace my uh, fluid master uh, toilet uh, bulb. Toilet fill bulb. Replacing it, I need to turn off that uh, bulb. I already turned it off by uh, turning it. Uh, Clockwise, I already turned it, and all I need to do is to remove the uh, the clapper bulb, the clapper uh, pill bulb, and I show you. Well, as you can see, this is an oil uh, toilet uh, clapper bulb. All I need to do is to remove this uh, fitting, and uh, using your hands, you could uh, able to remove it by uh, turning it. Uh, uh, What I usually do, I use this uh, adjustable wrench while holding this wrench like that. Uh, you can just turn this uh, counterclockwise and you are able to remove this uh, slapper. Turn it off. Keep turning. The problem with this, uh, the reason why I replace this because uh, it it didn't lock the bulb so the water just keep flowing so I don't want to waste the water and to pay for my uh, water bill so I need to replace this whole set and I'll get this one the new flapper the new uh, toilet uh, pill bulb this toilet pill bulb it comes with instructions uh, you know it's easy to follow the instructions, but I don't need to read these instructions. So there are tools that they will let you use it, uh, the pliers. But I use this uh, adjustable wrench, and uh, that's the only thing that I need. And uh, you need to use a towel as well. And that's how the instructions uh, look like. So that's the old one, and this is the original one. This is the uh, replacement. So I all I need to do just put it like this and just keep turning turning it clockwise Ooh. Wait. It's by turning it clockwise you are able to close this uh, uh, toilet pill bulb That's how it's set like that. So all you need to do, you need to tighten this, this nut, this plastic nut, and uh, you are set to go. So I already tightened this, this nut, this plastic nut. So all I need to do is to test this, if this thing uh, will work. So I need to... Uh, turn this... Uh, bulb into counterclockwise okay. well as you can see I already uh, turn it turn the uh, bulb so all I need to do to test this if this thing will work so let it kill that, that uh, toilet kill bulb should shut up now it's shut up by itself so before this thing it just keep uh, you know it just uh, this this plopper uh, this plopper plastic 
it just keeps sinking it won't uh it won't stay up like this because that's the only way to lock the uh you know to lock this uh this uh, mechanism there's a mechanism inside uh this uh, uh toilet uh plopper bulb a uh, plopper less uh toilet which is the toilet pill bulb so that's the only way that the water will stop but if your uh, toilet pill bulb it won't uh, stay up if it will stay like this so you're gonna have a problem that uh, you need to replace it or else uh, you will waste lots of water okay now it stays still now I don't have any problem all thing I need is to place the uh, place it back the top uh, cover the lid I hope you guys like this video I hope you guys learned today how to uh, remove and replace your toilet pill bulb which is made by uh, Glacier Bay this is the uh, best fit for Glacier Bay flapperless uh, toilet so until next time guys may you guys have a wonderful day today may God bless you all bye for now